So we're on, um, I think it's 307A. This is a single track that drops you down into Ming Cooley. So we're just starting at the top. And then there's the after. Once again, we always cut them wide. Um, trees tend to migrate, so this uh, uphill one hopefully will not come down on the trail. So here's the after, and right now this is a steep, steeper trail. This is all downhill, and typically you put your motorcycle in gear, it'll eventually move. So the hot ticket is just to have uh, this is a cut piece of an inner tube, and I usually have it over my master cylinder. But uh, this is also the KTM guys. This is a good way to put this on overnight and it'll uh, perk up your uh, brake lever. So poor man's uh, brake bleeder right there. So here's a tree that's fallen down the trail and where Oli's walking would be maybe a good workaround, but we like to keep the trail the trail. So there we go. He'll work on that end, I'll work on this end. So. Every once in a while I do fire up my chainsaw, just not videoing everything all the time and drinking margaritas. And then here's the after, in this part of the forest, lots of beetle kill. So the snow event that they had, we had up here, isn't as bad on this side of the mountain. So right now this is sort of normal cutting for us of uh, dead trees. So, so here's another, uh, Tree that delimit fell parallel to the trail, and then there is this tree, but it's stuck. It's stuck for a long time, so we don't touch those. Those are dangerous trees. So and then there's a step up there that uh, keep everybody on their. And here's the after. Ended up just cutting. Hopefully. That tree will grow. And then what we try to do is make sure there aren't any pokey branches in case somebody fell. I'm definitely afraid of somebody getting impaled, so sort of something we do on all the trails. And then this is where um, there's multiple lines, and actually this line over here is kind of fun and away from some of the dead trees, so. We're gonna block this off because past Oli's bike, you can see a tree down and we're not gonna cut it since it's uh, something I don't wanna cut today. Not a good day to die. So we're gonna drop this tree, which would have probably already fallen on the trail. So we're doing sort of a preemptive and then we're also blocking this trail. <clears throat> so now it's uh, one trail. Got these trees, actually it was uh, three of them. So now we're looking good and you can see going forward, there's a tree right there across the trail. All right, so. And then here's uh, the next tree. And then here's the after. Um, left that like that so it'll block this trail that was started here. Put that there, keep people on the trail. Here's typical deadfall, we're on Blank and Baker Flat, so once again trying to keep everybody on the trail. So, brown stuff, trail. Green stuff, not the trail. There's the after. Here's a typical dead tree. Um, the trail is, goes right through there. All right, here's the after, cut that tree. 
rolled everything downhill, so nice and clear. And uh, we're just coming down Blankenbaker 303 or 320, and we're about probably half a mile from the junction of 303 and whatever Blankenbaker is. So here's the tree. So there's the after. And then it looks like we have somebody up here. We got a volunteer bucker. <laughs> yeah. We're your uh, trail concierge. Yeah, for sure. All right. So we just passed the junction at 303 and I think uh, 320. So here's uh, some blowdown on both sides. Is past it. So now this is all clear. Try to cut it a little bit wide. Closed off all the trail to the left. And uh, all clear. All right. Did a bit of shrubbery. Cut this tree down, a couple others. Now at least you can see the trail. Everything's just super overgrown right now. Went all the way back here. Looking down, at least you can see the trail. All right, here's Ole. So this is another uprooted tree. There's a workaround, but it's super rough. So he started one cut right there. It was open up nice and then it Oh, he stuck it. Ooh, all right, so we'll get this done. And then uh, here's the after. So this is clear and uh, don't have to do the bypass, which is rough, and it stays 